we never set out to be a homeless outreach in and of itself. What we really set out to do is to build community with folks and address the, the felt loneliness that we, um, we know was out there. And okay, we just you know, opened up our doors as a church and um, got to know folks. And I've been out here two years. I've been out here on the highway in my own trucks. Sandra moved to Knoxville, Tennessee and started a new job two weeks before COVID shut everything down. I was stuck in my car, knew nobody, I didn't have a job. A new ministry called Fig Tree opened just before the pandemic. What we've heard from folks over the past year is, you know, the showers, the food, the laundry, it's all helpful. It, it keeps me going day to day. But why I keep coming back is that I feel safe here. I feel connected, you know, my name. We are ready to to walk alongside them. It's that same group of people and same volunteers week after week that are, are coming in and that community starts to develop. The atmosphere here is just love. Jesus said to Nathaniel, I saw you under the fig tree. Fig tree is a place to be seen and known. The camaraderie, just being able to sit and talk. Well, we've gotten the questions of, you know, are you getting people jobs and are you sobering people up? And, and I think those things happen, but that's not our goal. Our goal is really to, to let people know that they are created in the image of God and therefore they're loved and your life matters. Fig Tree is a place of healing and hope. A church member helps Sandra find housing. Volunteers say they come here to serve and find themselves blessed to be part of this community. Hey, I can't tell you the number of times I've come in here. Maybe I've had a bad day, or I've had something going on in my life, that I'll sit down or we'll be talking with some of the folks in our community. And just my conversation with them will make me feel better, will lift me up. You know, when you talk about a God thing, that's a God thing because we're all sort of here for each other leaning on each other. I promise you this, it is very much a two-way street here. It really is something that has, uh, in a lot of different ways, has changed my life.